He's turned up. Oh, shit. It's on? Yeah. Oh, oh sorry. Oh, man. Oh. Right, yeah. <laughs> I know. I know. It was yeah. recording. Oh, all right. Yo, peace of the game, peace of the game. Welcome to Culture Captivations. It's your boy BP, and today we in the Lions Den with Bishop Bang and my boy Young Coop, Young Hook Off. Y'all about to see, y'all about to get this workout with us real, real quick, you know what I mean? Stay tuned. About to go down. Let's go. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Culture captivations. Mm. Plug that in real quick. <laughs> so today, boys and girls, you are about to witness greatness. Real simple exercise I'm gonna bring before you today called the shoulder press. It's nothing real exciting to it. It builds your shoulders, you press up in the air, you know what I mean? Fellas, you want to press up, so that way you can hold the legs like this and get your press up motion, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? If you ain't shoulder pressing, you ain't holding them up right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. There you go. There you go. This is pre-sex workouts. Get your back up. Nobody was coming through here. Guess who was still in here? Making videos, dancing and acting a fool. Me, same energy. Same, all by yourself. All by myself, same grind. It don't stop, because I do what I do for me first, and I show up for me first. That's where people say, you know what? He's dedicated to himself. Why would I not come into that? Right. Anybody can go get a certification, go work somewhere, and that's your job. It's different when you got to run it and it's your passion, you got to show up. Because one thing about it, if you don't show up to the gym to train, they got other trainers. You don't even got to show up. It don't even matter if you show up. They're going to push you to somebody else. Right. That's why I say it's, it's a different when it's your own grind. When you got to open the door, you got to be the one to show up. It's different. You gotta it's different, different, bro. It's different when somebody think. else is in place. That's why I say it's, all, it's also okay, too, when you're racing with someone, so to say, not competing, but racing. Right. Somebody gonna have to keep going in order to keep the other person going. So that's why I said, if you find somebody that's consistent, they doing what you're doing, and you use them as motivation, you see them up in the morning, like Sean Clark. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. bruh's been, you know what I mean? So I see he's been consistent, and I can see the work. Right. I, bro got the bug, like, I'm motivated by you. You know what I mean? Because I see, when I know when I wake up, I'm expecting to see you. You gonna be up too, yep. You see what I'm saying? So it becomes that thing where I know I'm expecting to see you. I might be a couple minutes late, but, here I come, I see you, you're still there, yeah. Right. You're still there, that's why I always, bro, I'm a patient person. Just for people to see if they got that same energy next year. Right. Okay, do you got that same energy the next year? Yeah, that's how I be, like, I, bro, it's only so many when people. That, when that, uh, that detour hits yeah. you, oh, when it's that coming. throw you off track, yeah, it's you coming. like, bro, this is the, It's like, coming, it comes like, for everyone, it comes. It's coming, it comes, it comes all the time. And that's why I be thankful that yeah. I feed off of y'all. When you got certain people that you training and certain people, you just be like, bro, listen, that's why I, through the process, I make it tedious to sign up with me for a certain reason. If you're able to handle my delay of response to you, then I know that this is something you this really you want. Do, yeah. You see what I'm saying? Because people would just shut off and be like, you know what I mean? Oh, he didn't get back. Nah, let me see that you really, because your persistence shows that you want to be here. Right. If you just give up and be like, oh, he didn't, that's how your attitude already is. Right. If I'm in there, I'm in there. I didn't say nothing wrong with you not being here. Right. I just want to see how bad you but really want it. Like, well, I got to call and right remind right you. Yeah, nah. I'm a, I'm, yeah, I'm going to text you like, yo, don't forget about me. Right. Hey, what's up? Like, it's a certain, I can come through the day. You got a time at this time. I had people that, man, I had a dude that was just like, yo, I'm pulling up. Like, where you at? He was like, I'm pulling up. Came here, paid, signed up. Boom, he ain't have to wait through all that. Because he said, yo, listen, I'm out. I'm pulling up. I right. couldn't, I couldn't defeat. I couldn't, yeah, listen, yeah, you, you here. Yeah, you yeah I wouldn't say, no, nah, bro, not right. Nah, you're here right now. I'm signing up. I'm ready. That shows so much commitment. It was crazy. Right. So it's like, you had to decipher, especially when you using people to give you energy and to make what you do blossom. You want certain people. You want right. certain people that's going to work just as hard as you, right. man. 
and in, in here and outside of there. You know what I mean? So it's just like, I, I can't learn from nobody that don't got the drive that ain't getting up to go. Nah, you keep that lazy shit. To that's, what, that's what I get from the gang too. Like y'all, yeah. like I said, y'all inspired me. Even yeah. when I'm yeah. not yeah. even there, be like, yeah. damn yo. Like, like I yep. said, when I bought that joint, that was all that was strictly off of you and Carl in my head. Like yo, yeah. And yo, if it makes your business better, you might as well just get it. You see? Pull the trigger. I was like, I was like yeah, we get that joint. Yep. You know what I mean? But that comes from the so trigger. many times I hear just from the gang, mm. like. You hear that voice and it be like somebody like, yo, nah, push through, bro. Yeah, pull the nah, trigger. Nah, go ahead and do that, bro. Yeah. Pull the trigger, bro. Do yep. this, do that. You know what I mean? So that's why it's so good to be around yeah. people like you guys. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Get, 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 encourage and motivate each other. You know listen, what I mean? Like, listen, that's how it is. It's in this real life motivation off, right. off, 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 off right. scene, right. off script. Bro, I know everybody, listen, I need to see that same smile and that same energy when I see you in real life, right. not on right. social media. When right. you see people, hard oh, pom-poms on social media, you run past them in real life, they look like stress and depth is all over. Right. Like, oh. yo, yeah, the filters bring life. Nah, I need to see that same energy and feel that energy from you when I see you in person. You know what I mean? I need to see that I am a leader. I am... Bringing people into a, I'm yeah. bringing people into a new dispensation. Like it gotta be something crazy. Like I, that energy when you see certain people, you know, like yo, that's real. They are the same, right. on and off the scene, off the script. That's why I just be like, listen, man, it has to be that same energy all the time. You have to. It has to become who you are. You know what I mean, where you making beats, you crave it. You know what I mean? You gotta crave it. Like, yo, I'm not, I gotta make a beat today. It's, you know what I mean? I gotta do something today. Like, it gotta be crazy. I gotta be do, you gotta do my creative. I gotta take pictures, yeah. Right. I, gotta, I gotta use that thing. They were saying how you have, you have your conscious, you have your subconscious, and they had you have a super subconscious. Right. You see what I'm saying? So they was like, your super subconscious and your subconscious don't know the difference between right and wrong, what's real and what's fake. So your super subconscious is what the creative comes from. Right. That drive of the unbelievable thing where you think it might not happen and it happens. Right. Because in, if when your subconscious, your super subconscious is knowing that all things is possible, like the big optimistic person. Right. Like that is the difference of what you think in your conscious mind. Because your conscious mind, what you say, oh, I can't do that. That's going to be too hard. Right. The more you have that in you. It's going to start so to take over. It's going to take yeah. over when your subconscious is going to automatically think we can't, we can't do it. Do it. Yeah. And your super subconscious ain't even going to work because your subconscious, you can't get to that, that realm. That's the, that's the believing in miracles. That's the believing in the impossible. Right. That's the knowing that without a doubt you believe that, look, this can happen. So that's why when you see people that be saying things that's unexpected to some people, it wasn't. It wasn't because I'm used to those type right. of things happening to where it's mind blowing to you, but not to me because right. I believe in the impossible. When you hear people say, oh, I, already, I already knew I was going to be up. Like, I knew I was going to yeah. be up. I knew I yeah. was going to be up. I just you, had to figure out how I was, was going to get, gonna get there. there right. I knew I was yep. going to be And that's, that's, the, that's the conscious mind. So then that's the subconscious. Yep. Yeah, the, the that's super subconscious. Yep. You have to be like, all right, well, yeah. we got to figure yeah. out a way to yeah. make yeah. this money. Yeah. And, yeah. and, it, and it's going to give you ideas to where your conscious, the thing that thinks, Right or wrong, it's still going to rational. Like, that's right. Right. This is it. I'm not no fairer and I'm going to do it because you already talked yourself into it. And when them opportunities come, you spot it and you know right. this is it. It pops up. You see up. what I'm saying? Exactly. Even if it only adds a notch to your belt or something that is, it still happens. So you know, like, it you shows say, you on the right path. If nothing right. Else. So you be like, all right, I'm going to make uh, $2,000, you know what I mean, in two weeks off of my job or what I do. So once you do that, you can tell yourself, I can do other things, bro. Listen, you know, I'm going to make 4000 It's going to come. You're going to figure out a way. Like, yo, I add 4000 on there. Like, yo, next you know, you're you making, you making money. Like, it's, that's why I said when you start making it, it's nothing to you. You're going to always be around money. I don't care if it's fine. You find, like, money, you just going to have it. It's going to be around. You know that every day I'm going to get up, it's going to bring me something closer to my goals. Right. And that's why I say about being in shape. Listen, it's not going to just happen. And if you're not in the shape, bro, listen, you could be in so much of bad shape that by the time something's about to happen, you don't feel like it. You're not up to it. Somewhere you might have needed to be, you don't go because your body doesn't allow you. That's why I said, listen, everybody right now laughing. People like you, cool, you're 20 something. But people that's in their 40s, not taking care of themselves, how far do you think you're going to go in business? 
eating like that and being like that. How far do you really think you're going to go? Before now, your business takes off, you in the hospital, diabetes, heart attack. They want to end. And you go right back yes. to square zero. You get into where you need to be, but you ain't taking care of yourself. It stops right there. It stops before it even flourishes. Right. And if you look at half of the people that in their 40s and some of us that didn't get, listen, you, how far do you think you're going to go? It's, you're not going reverse. You ain't even in shape. Get lazy. It's like, bro, listen, you start to get lazy. I don't care what nobody say. It sound all good in there. And, and you can post all day and make it look like you at the spot. When it comes to that real energy, you have none. It's, it, it doesn't exist. It don't. Listen, it, it doesn't it exist. Don't. That's From why I said like first hand experience. It doesn't exist. At 380 pounds, I didn't have no energy. Yeah, it doesn't exist, man. You don't have none. And it shows, it shows. I mean, you can paint it up, make it look good, make it all of that. Listen, it's about people are so time consumed. It, that's how they are. Like you, it's not right now. People see it, you know, that's gonna be fire. They be like, oh yeah, that's dope. They might not catch on to it until two or three years later. That's how I be. Like I remember I didn't like pop smoke. And then you know, it took me a while to listen to it. Now like, damn, I wish bro was did. Like this joint would have been popping. You know what I mean? But it took me a while to realize it. That's how people are with stuff, bro. You can give them something and they'd be like, because there's so much pollution of stuff that don't work and scammers and mass manipulation. Right. So you got to weed through so much. The flower got to come through all these weeds because weeds grow, bro. But in them weeds, you see the flowers. You see the things that matter within them weeds. Right. You got to just keep going. You got to move through the weeds. And that's the pollution of social media. There's weeds. There's million beat makers there's a million rappers anybody but when it comes to putting the real work in it don't go no further than that yeah. and that's why i said give time with tail time tells on everybody bro everybody we'll look up i'm 41 before you know it i'll be 45 I'm trying to get to my next point but i'm one thing for sure i'm okay because i feel great don't feel a day of it don't feel like i feel like it's just beginning and i'm ready to run i'm fully energized Listen, 40, 50, I'm, listen, all oh, that's going to be open. I'm going to run it because that's how I feel. Like, it matters. Like, that's why I say it matters. The energy you put behind what you do, what you think, what you study, how you approach life, all of that matters in all the aspects in order for it to really be open. Because one thing about it, your weight, that stuff is going to bother you. You act like it don't. You mask it. That's the things that pop up in your subconscious. Yeah. Your fears. Yeah, buddy. You got something on the table that you're really not proud of that you ain't fixing. That thing's gonna handicap you. You can't have the whole thing and I, that's why you have some that make it get famous and then lose weight and, and you see them on the trend and on the wave. Listen, bro, you wanna be able to make that money, be to all your events, keep a hold of what your income is, know who's trying to do what and this, this, and this. That takes energy. If you don't got the energy for that, you burn out. Your body don't allow you. Your mind's not going to allow you. Because one thing about it, I don't care. Your, your mind can be only so strong. If your body doesn't match your mind, your, your body's going to win. It's going to win. You know it's, what I mean? It's, it's going to win. Without a doubt. It's going to Without win. I don't doubt. care what nobody right. says. You can be the most smart. You're not taking care of your health. Your body's going to win. Because if the body shuts down, I don't care what you know. You know what I mean? You be like somebody, you, your body don't work, but your mind do. What good are you? Think somebody's coming to watch, talk to you in the hospital, be able to get tips? What can you really give? Your mind works, but your body don't. They come in to grieve you, not to learn from you. From the state you put yourself in. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's, it's just different. serious dudes that I know yeah. that's like it's mid different. to late 40s, they die. Mm -hmm. And you're like, bro, that's. Yeah, it's crazy. You're only 47 yeah, years old. It's crazy, like, bro. Like, nah, bro, that shit. Don't get me wrong, things happen, but yeah, that's not sure. always the case. But I, yes. I know. Yes. They didn't die because things happened. It yes. wasn't like an accident. Neglect. It was, it was neglect. It was yep. years of smoking, drinking. Yep. Neglect. Uh, drinking coffee, drinking, yep. eating fucked up shit. Like, yeah, it's neglect, man. It comes for you. It's going to come. That's why I be proud when I see dudes your age starting young. Like, oh, bro, listen, in fitness, do you know where you'll be at by the time you even reach my age? It's, it'll be crazy what you know. You'll be here. You'll have so much under your belt. Where you make music, you a trainer, and you do fashion, modeling, all of that, bro. All of that's on your table. Everything's on your table. Right now, you can do everything. Because you around soaking up game from each 
section that you need to be. Yeah, you can be a photographer, everything, bro. You can be everything. Like, that was a visual on Blue Yeah, you see what I'm saying? Like, you do everything. You know what I mean? Be like, nah, nigga, I know this game. I got this game already. Yeah, you, you figure. You the it. big homie. They be like, yo, honestly, you the big homie because I know I've been in, I've been in the room with people that had more experience than me. I come from that room. When you come from that room. You got a great advantage of that room. In Twenty years from now, it don't seem, it don't seem like that long. That shit fly, bro. Yeah. <laughs> that shit fly. Yeah, you gotta take care of yourself, you know man. I mean? So yeah, you take, utilize this game. time right now. Yep. To just become a better person, like fuck all that other shit. Yep. If it ain't making you better, it ain't even worth doing for real. Like that's that's one thing I would say in my twenties. I'm like, bro, if it don't make you better, don't even waste your time with it for real, because it's gonna be a waste of time. You know what I mean? You gonna be thirty years old trying to get that time back. It ain't, ain't none of that time coming back. You know what I mean? Like, but. You on the right path already, so you know what I mean. By the time you forty, you gonna be showing up on the young boys like, young nigga, that's all you got, damn nigga. We lifted three thousand pounds, nigga. You want me to ask you Oh shit! All that, all that shit's important, man. Cause life is good when you feel good. So that was the day in the lines, thing, y'all. We'll be back. For more exclusive lines than content. Big weight workouts. Mm. Big dog shit, you hear me? Yeah. Ain't no games. Getting this work. Uh-huh. Come get some of this work. It's lines then. Culture Captivation, we'll see you on the next joint. Aha, yeah. peace.